tuned, Diane Raphael and Terry Crews. Now, Terry, we've got to congratulate you on this incredible book, Tough, oh. My Journey, The True Power. <laughs> now, this is your second memoir. I think it's incredibly powerful what you've written about. Tell everybody why you decided to write this. Well, you know, I actually did one memoir in 2014 called Manhood, and you know, I thought that would be it. I said, this is a, you know, this is the this is my will and testament. And then a whole bunch more life happened. Mm. And also you discover more about yourself. And I'm really big on therapy. And uh, you know, I was a few years into therapy when I wrote the first one, and then I continued that journey on, and I had a lot more to say. So many things happened. I mean, being joining the Me Too movement and all uh, the pandemic and, and my, my wife recovering from cancer during this time. It, it was just so much to talk about. And especially being a man now, the new definition of what manhood is and tough, being tough is, is not being able to throw punches, but being able to take them, to be able to endure. And, you know, where I grew up, it was a whole other way. And I, I want to say this, because he would never say it, uh, you know, James would never, ever say it, but when I remember I was going through all this stuff with Me Too, and I got the best message from you. A private message went right to me. And I, I'm literally very emotional right now just thinking about it, but it helped me get through one of the toughest times in my life, man. And I just want to thank you for that, James. You are the man. I love it. Dude. I love it. Incredible. I do. I think, I think what you... What you talk about in the book, I think... Because you're right, being a man and what is it, macho and all those things, look, all the things that people look at me and see. Um, <laughs> exactly. You um, are toxic masculinity. I am, I am, I am. I am. <laughs> me and all the other Broadway guys, this you is know? What, this is what and it looks like. This is what we're trying to take down. That's correct. We have to. <laughs> a threat. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I've and been I think so what uncomfortable <laughs> sitting here. I have no idea. But I think what you've talked about in the book is incredibly important. I'm certain, I'm certain that to many, many people, to many, many men, this is going to mean a great deal and make them change their really point is. of view and have different thoughts and different views on things. And I think it's amazing yes. that you've written it. I really, really do. Yes, yes, yes. It's yes. full of wisdom. I cannot recommend it enough. It really is. I really, really do. Uh, now, June, you and I, we have a mutual friend. If we're talking about advice, if we're talking about life, we have a mutual friend in uh, RuPaul, That's right. who we adore. And Ru, right. Ru gave you some advice well, for posing on the red carpet. I told him he did an episode of Grace and Frankie, and I said, I'm always so uncomfortable having my photo taken. I never know what to do with my hands. I never know how to look and what to do with my body. It's just an unnatural experience. And he told me, and I've used it since then, that when you're looking at a camera, the only thing you need to say to yourself in your mind are two words, and that's, I know. <gasps> wow. Are you, wait, hang on, wow. hang on, hang on. Say it again. Wow. Say it again, say it again. I know. Yeah. That is the secret. That's, that's it. it. That's it. Well, hang on. Well, what does that what does that look like? Can well, you show us? What does yeah, that look like? You're on the red carpet. What is that? Yeah, no, I'll give you the full. Oh, <laughs> kind of. okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. And he also, because I did say to him, well, what do you do with your hands? And he said, you, because nobody ever knows what to do with their hands. And he said, you just thread the needle. <gasps> wow. Thread the needle. Oh, wow. Thread the needle. And so I know is just, it's that. <laughs> and it's kind of a look. Should we hang like, on? Let's let's all give please. it a try. Let's all give please, it a try. Please, okay, Terry, so come on. We're all on the red carpet now. We're Ready all on the red carpet. Wait, hang on. Okay. Get yourself together. Ready the needle. I know. Mm -hmm. I know. Wait, you don't say it out loud. Oh, I feel oh, like I need sorry. to be really clear about sorry, that. Sorry. You don't, Both of you. Don't. That's an internal monologue. What if you feel you should? <laughs> you I, please don't. What if you feel you should arrive at an event and actually God. say it? I know. I want to say it. I didn't know. I want to say it. No. I want to oh. say it. I want to say I didn't know I I... that specific, but yeah, that's an internal thought. I don't see. I, I, know. I don't know about this. Yeah, you do. Don't you, you don't. This. You don't know. You don't know. Do you know who does know? Do you know who does know? I know. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, June, <laughs> Diane, Ray Beal, Terry Crews, Amos Lee's here. We come back. Come back, everybody. You've just heard from guests.